and blessings. Today, I want to talk to you about House Bill 2258 in Kansas. It is time for pagans and conjure people to wake up. We have been passive in politics too long, and it is time for us to wake up and smell the cauldron because we are being taken advantage of. To quote Malcolm X, we are being hoodwinked, bamboozled, led astray, run amok. We need to now make ourselves known in the political circuit. We need to be aware and we need to be vocal. They just passed House Bill 2258 in Kansas. Governor Sam Brownback just passed it. And this bill talks about TANF. Now, I know most of you are saying, or some of you are saying, or none of you are saying, that TANF, which is a welfare program, does not affect me. True. Or false. Um, basically, TANF, the welfare program, affects a large amount of our communities. And House Bill 2258 says that you cannot spend your TANF money on movies or luxury items or taking your kids to the pool. So basically, it is punishing children for economic issues caused by our government and economic issues that people have found themselves in during this recession. Now, why am I talking to you and why is this, why do we need to become active? And that's because of this. These are what we like to call tarot cards. House Bill 2258 has declared that psychics are in the same realm as movies, swimming pools, and other entertainment and luxury items. Okay. I know that I have been insulted for having to put things like for entertainment purposes only. I'm not an entertainer. Yes, I was an actor back in high school, but I'm not an entertainer now. I work as a spiritualist. I help advise people on their journey. I walk with them through issues and hardships and help them to accomplish goals that they thought were unaccomplishable. The fool's journey is the everyday person. It walks, it walks people down their life's journey. I don't think walking people down their life's journey is an entertainment. A lot of times the road is bumpy and hard. And we walk through it with them. We are not entertainment. So to deny people access to this kind of information is infringing on our First Amendment right, our freedom of religion. And in House Bill 2258, nowhere did Sam Brownback say that TANF money could not be given to a church. What he said is that they can't be given to psychics. So... What I'm saying is, it is time to wake up and become active. In the description, I will give you Chief Justice Nuss's phone number. You need to call him and say, we are not fools. We may follow the fool's journey or the everyman's journey, but we are not fools. We will not be silent. 
even though this may not be in your state, you need to act up because this creates precedent. This new bill creates precedent that can be put in other states. We need to act up, be vocal, and not be quiet anymore. Too many of our people are affected by laws such as these. It's time to wake up and smell the cauldron. I say, Papa O.